teacher talking sports what it does what it do how we live and we've heard from lebron james and other members of the lakers how they've been unfairly officiated uh, during parts of the season of late we saw that celtics game where jason tatum um, seemed to clearly foul LeBron at the end of the game. LeBron missed. Game was forced to go into OT where they lost. There was another play with Christian Wood fouling LeBron. Wasn't called. So the narrative has been that LeBron and the Lakers have not been getting the calls. Well, Ben Rohrbach of Yahoo Sports decided to do a little research on this. So he says he came up with the Sleepless Nights Index, assessing late game officiating favorability for every NBA team. So he says Sleepless Nights because when the NBA um, came out with their statement after the Tatum play on LeBron, it mentioned that, um, you know, the refs are going to have sleepless nights due to this incident. So he goes on to mention that... um, see here in the last two minute report of saturday's game the league identified two missed calls at the end of regulation tatum's foul and an offensive foul by anthony davis that would have negated beverly's go-ahead basket 18 seconds earlier Uh, both teams benefited from missed calls but the focus stayed on the final play of course because it is lebron james it's the league's highest profile franchise as Borback decides to mention so he goes on to write so i decided to review you every last two minute report for the Lakers this season just to see if an assessment of every late call in their 19 close games supported or deemed denied their claims the NBA deemed its officials had missed a total of 34 calls or no calls in those games and 21 of them were 61.8 percent had favored the Lakers so he ended up doing it for every team So the only team in the NBA who got a higher percentage of calls in their favor in the last two minutes was the Los Angeles Clippers. Had 63.2% of the calls go in their favor. So second second is the Lakers at 61.8%. They also had 21 calls go in their favor. That's the second most in the NBA Only to the Dallas Mavericks, who had 23, but the Mavericks also had a lot of uh, calls that were deemed wrong, 50 in total, um, so not even half of them. So um, only five of the league's 30 teams had either more than 60% or fewer than 40% missed calls go in their favor. Uh, So the Lakers, according to this, not being singled out. So it mentions that Mavericks big man Christian Wood should have been whistled for a foul for another late last second play that would have also put James on the free throw line with a chance to win a game in regulation James made sure to mention that after the Boston loss as well what he did not mention were the three previous incorrect calls that went in the Lakers favor so at least according to this report it looks like they definitely have not been singled out that they haven't been um, receiving an unfair amount of bad calls of course they're more high profile because it's lebron james and it's the lakers and i will say that the last two minute report sometimes um you know i don't see them all but sometimes i don't agree there was the play um russell westbrook on joel Embiid, where joel Embiid had hold of his wrist and they basically said there wasn't enough contact. Um, to me, that's a foul. And then there was uh, the Knicks-Raptors game on Martin Luther King Day where uh, R.J. Barrett went up for a dunk to tie it, send the game to OT. Maybe should have been an and one. Um, Scotty Barnes, was it Scotty Barnes? I believe it was Scotty Barnes. Uh, clearly had a hold of his bicep. Um, was his off-shooting hand, but, you know, it's still... To me, it should have been called a foul. Uh, But what do you guys think? Does this uh, report by Ben Rohrbach debunk the theory that the Lakers are being unjustly officiated by the officials? Or do you think they still have a case even with this report? Let me know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe. Tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend, subscribe. Like the video, share the video, hit the bell for notifications. I'm out.